Hello, hello everybody. Angie here. I am coming on to do the um, daily make for the hashtag Ephemeramber, a month long of events of daily ephemera makes. And here is my journal with little Effie. And Effie's coming in. He says hi to everybody. Hello, Effie. And let's see what we can do. We are on December 18th, and the prompt is plaid and polka dots. Please touch. Okay, so plaid and polka dots. Excuse me, Effie. We're going to need a little bit of room so I can bring my book in for a minute. Now, this particular daily make I did off camera, um, and I'm sorry about that, but I haven't been feeling good the last all weekend, and um, I just mustered up enough strength just to throw this um, page together. Let me tell you guys, just real quick, and we'll get on to our fun stuff. That shingle shot is absolutely nothing to play around with. For one, it is strong and potent, and it'll knock you on your butt for a couple days. But two, which is kind of rare, I guess, maybe for myself, but I got an infection in my arm from the site where they poked me. I don't know how it happened. But um, yeah, I was down and out for from Friday till today. And I um, feel like crap still a little bit, but I'm doing better. Okay, so enough, enough. So be careful if you guys are getting those shingle shots. Because, woo, no fun. All right, plaid and polka dot. Here is what I did. I just took the digital page um, from the kit, from the Effie kit, Defend Remember kit, and it had a page from the kitchen, okay, a full page, if you, and I showed that whole kit at the beginning of the series, so if you are curious as to what the full page looks like, you wanna, might want to go back to day one and take a peek, but it was just a page of the kitchen, he's up on the counter doing his dishes, so I cut it down to fit my page, and I cut off the dishes there, so I just brought them over to this side, I fussy cut them out, and just pasted them over on this side is all I did. And then I made me some plaid and polka dot curtains. And I think they go tremendously well with the colors on this page. I just did a really quick zigzag stitch all the way around, brought in some gold beads as some curtain ties. And um, for the rod, I just used a wooden skewer and then a couple beads, some wooden beads, and then two more of the gold beads up on top. And I think it came out really cute. And he was holding a dish towel. So I just um, cut off a little scrap piece and made him a dish towel mat to match his curtains. And as you can see, I stitched some scraps. So it goes plaid, polka dot, plaid, polka dot. So they do touch and just did a tie back. I wanted to, and I may still try to figure out a way when I have more mental capacity <laughs> and energy um, I wanted to cut the window open to where like you open in it or something and have a view of something I don't know I don't know if I could still do it because I have something on the other side but that was my original thought um, but really I just really wasn't feeling up to it but I did want to get this video out and up on time so this is where I left it very simple but oh so adorable I think with this kit, he is developing such a cute little house. I've been trying to use the digital throughout these makes every day as much as I can. So I've used his house, I've used his kitchen, I've used his bathroom. Um, really all that's left is his bedroom. So I'm gonna have to try my best to get that worked into one of the daily makes before the series is ended. I've got a few pages left, he's working like outside of his in his yard there creating something i've got a few pages left this is his living room i'm gonna have to try and get that in there somewhere and another like maybe a living room scene but yeah i'm really having fun with this digital set it's a lot of fun and this is my make for today guys i hope you like what you see thank you so very much for stopping by my channel i really really do truly appreciate it and I will see you for tomorrow, which is nature's treasure. All right. 
I'd love it if you leave me a comment, leave me a like, tell me what you think of my cute little curtains. <laughs> or should I say Effie's curtains? Yes, yes, Effie. I'm sorry, I corrected myself. Effie's kitchen curtains. All right, guys, take care and God bless. Bye-bye.